Hey there, folks. Welcome back to Private Eye Doll. I'm Zerfall. I'm Mall Dragon. And uh, you may remember this, folks, but uh, our friend Yuko here uh, isn't so friendly anymore. They've gotten very upset that we've caught them out. She has a sword now. I want a sword. Why don't I get a sword? Yeah. So uh, we, we've got a. It's, it's turned into QTEs. <laughs> um, and I've got to use my uh, uh, C Q C's on her, maybe. CQC, uh, <laughs> close quarters combat. Yeah. And if that if, if that doesn't work, there's always nano machines. Um, nano machines. <laughs> but, but but we're gonna let her get us this time because we got a save state here now from uh, ending the video. So I'm not gonna dodge. Just like Ayaka, there's not a chance I'll leave you alive. Oh wow, she she really wasn't um, regretful over what happened. No, not not really, is she? Run for it! Hurry, get out of the room! Hey, 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 Navi! Spoilers. That's what we're. <laughs> wow. <laughs> oh, Eric. Me, me, me. <laughs> <laughs> Navi's calling in on the codex. Oh man, this means that uh, game overs and other uh, parts of the game are going to have uh, unique stuff. Uh, it's over. I'm blacking out. Ayaka, I'm sorry. Wow. Game over. A special... Uh image too we will have to make sure we die as many ways as possible i guess now i mean i have we seen any situations that feel like we could not have died? yet but i wonder yeah. if the first um if the first story they make it purposefully like hey here's some stuff that might kill you although so far all that stuff has tended to uh have something to do with the story later anyway so like I'm hoping that if we get her, like you, like we thought last week, if we get her in front of uh, one of the suits of armor, maybe it'll fall on her or something. Yeah. Um, I'm curious what it continue does. It brings us right back here. Oh, that's actually very generous. Because we had actually lost a little bit of time. Oh. Oh, see? Oh, see? There's like uh, all sorts of unique scenarios about based on which way you push. Yeah. Yeah, I miss being able to read that. Yeah. Oh, it was, it, we've been driven up against the wall. I didn't didn't really like. I, I I was just so flabbergasted by this being unique that I didn't even think of that. <laughs> and here I thought uh, to cut you down in a heartbeat so you wouldn't suffer. Cease your useless struggles. Run for it! Hurry! Get out of the room! Even though you're trapped in the corner. Yeah, unless she knocks you back if you try to go towards yep. her. I wonder if you could go up and around if you were kind of fast enough, but uh, maybe not. I'm going to dodge towards the couch here, too, and see what happens. Because I wonder if you can, like, stumble onto the couch or something. No, that's not such a, such a bad way to go. But I, I think it's that... No, I don't think you have enough time if you do that. Yeah, do you know what's crazy is there's still time on the timer. Well, I mean, yeah, but so I think I think, that's you, I think you've got a combination still. of a uh, limited number of moves and mm -hmm. uh, limited uh, time as well. I'll tell you what we're going to do, though. We're going to load the state so we can pretend like that never happened. I, I noticed that the uh, the side door, which was o is, is open in the uh, save state, was closed in the. Uh, um... uh, yeah, because I wonder if because we came in through the side door when we, I think, were playing, but yeah. perhaps when it continues, they're like, oh, we don't know what door you came through, so we're just gonna assume you came through the bottom door. Yeah, but that makes me wonder if uh, if the door is closed, does that mean that you can uh, screw things up? Because like right now. It looks like you could go straight out that side door. Which is what my plan was. Can 
Such a nimble brat. Go obediently to Ayaka's side. This is no joke. Oh, yeah. She's seriously persistent. Oh, she bumped the wall. Yikes, that must have hurt. God, she's hellbent, huh? And then she knocks us around to here, so I'd imagine that it's just slightly different depending on uh, what door you go. Yeah. <laughs> Classic anime. <laughs> this is the end. If I kill just if I just kill you, none will be left to know of me. When the day breaks, everyone's eyes will be on me. If I'm popular, they'll surely gaze upon me too. There's no escape! I kind of feel like, uh, if you... If you go murders May here, there's no... There isn't going to be any doubt of who did it. I could still be that one guy that's a big jerk. I... He came back and killed her and then got back at the bus and left. Yeah, I, I think that the... I, I, I think that's probably going to be revealed to have not worked. But, <laughs> you know, who knows? Ayaka, I'm sorry. You'll die in the end, just like Ayaka. Yuko. Yuko. Hey, I was right about oh, this guy. Oh. She... Geki? We're getting she saved? No, I wanted her to get killed by the, the stat, by the armor. I know, that would have been much better. I didn't want to believe it. It was you after all, Yuko. I, I... Oh, she's backing up! Oh, okay. I loved you. But you wouldn't look at me. What you saw was always the actress in the camera. So I thought if I... If I was just popular, I could get you to look at me. Even if... Even if it was just through the camera, I could get you to pay attention to me. But it's over, isn't it? Now that you've found out. I... Can't live anymore. Oh, she's just jumping. Oh! I'm... Disappointed, actually. Oh, she's flashing back. Oh no! Missed. Oh wow! Is he gonna save May? Maybe she just uh, lands on something soft. Well, look who was there. What? Ah, she threw herself too hard. <laughs><笑>あ、<笑><笑> <laughs> She's like, I wanted you to die, but not like this. No, that's good. Have her uh, stand trial. I've just broken my back. It's fine. Yuko-san, <laughs> All right, so apparently she's lawful good. Yep.
I was I was kind of hoping that that was going to be a bad ending, uh, and and you'd both die because you you didn't go the right way. You, yeah. All right. Well, it looks like we got to save this here. Data loading. That's a very odd. Like the the. Uh... It's like they, they tried to digitize a, a hand drawing and they were like, just go with whatever the first scan is. Yeah, it's it's very oddly digitized. ごめんな、ヤカ。仕事ばかりで、ろくにお前のことを構ってやれなかった。あ、ヤカ。こんな父さんを Vain Dance in the Morning Breeze. And it's part one. Now, I wonder if that was setting something up with this uh, next story, or if that was uh, the ending of the first one. That's, uh... I guess we'll have to find out. Silent Sea, huh? These cutscenes have much quieter <laughs> sound than the yeah. actual game. No. no, no, it's supposed to be a three-hour tour. <laughs> I was going to say, a 30-hour voyage, that sounds a little safer. Oh, <laughs> My best friend died. Excuse like, me. She's like, mine almost died, but let me mourn. Yeah. The, being sad won't bring her back, but having your one eye slightly too far to the side in this picture will. <laughs> oh. I was hoping she would change a little bit more. <laughs> well, she's got to be careful now, though, because we've seen what happens to our sidekicks uh, <laughs> so far. What are you zoning up for? I've already gotten dressed, and now we're in a hotel room. <laughs> She zoned out so hard, she's already on the boat. <laughs> nope. Sorry if it's a little loud, folks. Do you need to edit the... Uh... I think I think the talking... Yeah, I, 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 I upped the volume for the last scene, and then... Uh, oh, okay. Lowered it back down now. Am I really doomed to get dragged along on this? Apparently so. Yeah. You're still saying that? Sorry, but we left yesterday. <laughs> well, how many hours into the 30-hour trip are you? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, well. Guess complaining won't change anything. I don't get to go on a trip like this every day. So I better try to enjoy it. That's true. It's normally trips to haunted houses uh, um, with crazy ladies who are bent on uh, murdering someone for their own uh, status and position. Yeah, I was uh, very worried that May might uh, just push her friend here off the deck late at night and we're going <laughs> to have to figure out a way of getting off the boat uh, without suspicion. All right, how about we go grab some breakfast? <sighs> You've got a look that says you only care about the food. Oh, just for that, uh, May's gonna kill you and stuff you under the bed now. He, uh, I, I'm so sorry. Are you all right? 
I I'm so sorry. I wasn't aware you were outside. Uh, no, no. I wasn't paying attention either. Begging your pardon. Okay, I want to I want to make a quick note that uh, that the door opened outward. He's very dumb if he's walking that close to the wall with doors that open outward. Well, to be fair, our door opened inward. Yeah, but uh, <laughs> maybe it's the only one on the boat. I, I still think you could you could see it. You could tell the hinges would be on the outside. Yeah, well, he he's an old man. He'd have to get pretty close to see the hinges. <laughs> But never mind that. Looky here, you dropped your precious ring. Oh, precious. My precious. Oh, my apologies. It's like I've been saying, right? It's not something you can just walk around with. Leave the ring behind. To be fair, she was wearing it on her hand instead of just carrying it around. <laughs> Well, but was she? Ah, uh, my sincerest apologies. Yeah, I mean, we, we don't know. We don't know yet. Ah, uh, my sincerest apologies, everyone. Our carelessness has been a bother. Please excuse us. Nope, nope, definitely not the only door that opens uh, into the hall. <laughs> but man, that was one heck of a ring, huh? How much must that thing be worth? Enough to make you want to steal it, right? Oh, I already did. That's what we call a crime. It doesn't sound much like a joke coming out of your mouth, Motoko. <laughs> Dang. Are those two newlyweds? They sure seem close. Yeah, maybe they're just having an affair. Newlyweds? How nice. What's that mean, Motoko? You want to get married? <laughs> Don't say stupid stuff, as if! <laughs> 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 sorry, sorry. Anyways, what should we do now? <laughs> Go do whatever you want. I'll come along, though. Of course. This guy seems to be uh, nursing a headache or something. <laughs> Sorry, but could you leave me alone? Oh, yeah, it is. It's Ayaka's father. Mm. Is he seasick? He looks kind of pale. Probably is. I'll let you have her. Ma'am, I'm afraid you're not allowed to come back here. What if I go slightly north? Well, again? where did the guy, where did the other two come from? They technically they... were here. Oh, okay, so they were sitting down. Maybe. Okay. I don't know, I didn't see them sitting actually, so. Yeah, that, that's that's what I was wondering. It seemed like they were just passing through. Well, apparently I can look at this chair. Oh, interesting. Wait, wait. That's weird. Mm. So both of the buttons... The uh, affirmative and the non-affirmative button... Uh, open this menu now, whereas before it was only the non-affirmative button. Mm. Oh, here we go. We gotta recap all these people. Maybe we'll save this for uh, third of the next video, though. Oh, okay. Oh, he started following. Hey, are you all right? Hey, Joe. Hey, sorry. I'll deal with ships well. I'll be fine on my own. All right, I guess that just started happening so that you could decide to interact with him if you wanted to. Well, at least he didn't vomit on us, you know? Nope, there he goes. Oh! Oh, Catch wow! Catch a mid-vomit! Oh, that's amazing! 
<laughs> that's that's pretty great. Uh, um, I'm I'm a fan. I'm a big fan of the sprite work now. <laughs> I remember you. You were in a commercial, right? Uh huh. Navi was in it too. <laughs> Cute. So is this Orica? Hey, when you're available to buy, we'd like to have you too. That's slavery! No, we didn't catch this guy before uh, he noticed the seasickness. Is he seasick? I wonder if he'll be okay. Is that man alright? Yeah, we checked on him. He said, uh, leave him alone. Yep. Alright, don't talk to me! <laughs> and multiple ways to go now. Is this ship rusty? Ah, uh, no, that's a different game. Ha, ha. Don't make me stab you. That's the way back to our stuff. I don't know that mm -hmm. I want to go there yet. Oh, now they're both walking. I can talk to him instead. Oh, what, a won what wonderful weather. And it was worth the trouble of taking a vacation to come on this trip. Is she saying the same thing as before? The boat, it's pretty fast, isn't it? it? It feels like I could fall overboard. I'm scared. Hmm, I oh, who you don't have next. to worry. You're you're not you're not married to a lady, a murderous lady who's having an affair with the acting captain. It's fine. Well we don't know that for sure. Maybe the guy she's with well, is, is the guy she's with, but her wife is secretly here and uh you're not going to let us on the bridge? Sorry, ma'am. This area is off limits. <laughs> no need to say anything so uptight. No, I'm required to. Come in, our lovely passengers. But promise me you won't touch the machinery. Touch, 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 touch. This is going to be annoying because, like... Oh, no, if you're against the wall, it doesn't happen. Okay. Maybe it'll, it'll change. Though. Like, maybe we just can't interact with anything right now, so they don't allow it. Hmm, so this is where they pilot the ship. It's the first time I've seen one. Uh, I I'm sorry, it's not pilot, it's make go. This is where they make ship go. Well, what do you think of our silent sea here? Hope we've got the ship to your liking. The voyage is going exceptionally well. We should be able to make port around 3 o'clock in the afternoon, as scheduled. Well, it's a good thing that we're not on a uh, three-hour tour. Oh, that man, he's such a child. But why? Let's go after him now. Why is he such a child? No, they've changed positions. <laughs> <laughs> the breeze out fe outside feels so nice. And the ocean's so pretty. Just like you. <laughs> oh, that man's such a child. With it, you. This is embarrassing. And he feels like the king of the world. Nah, I was in the wrong position for that. Oh, they're just precious. I think I'm going to be sick. Well, they're, we're, we're at the, we're by the railing, so if you're going to be sick, it's a perfect yep. place. And for I can't it. look at him actually here, so. Let's click back here real, real quick and talk to the uh, captain's buddy. Say the same Button thing. Navigator. Say the same thing. Perfect. That's what I like to see. <laughs> um, I believe you're May Star, aren't you? Uh, that's May the Star. You're in those TV ads, and I've never seen you in the papers. Uh, and I've even seen you in the papers. This is sure a surprise, though. I didn't know the buzz was about such a cute detective. I like the emphasis is on detective and not cute. Like, you'd think he'd be like, he's like, I didn't know the buzz was about such a cute detective. You know what I mean? Like, <laughs> he's more shocked by the detective. I'm an actress! Right, uh, an actress detective. Got it. Let me make the same mistake twice. Yeah. Alright, let's get back to our happy couple. 
Maybe we can just witness the first murder and be like, hey, cool. You, you go around the other side? Yeah, now, now you can be king of the world. Don't rock the boat, baby. Don't rock uh, the boat. Maybe the dad is not uh, barfing anymore. And if he is, we'll go through the middle of the ship to get back to the uh, happy couple. Yes, he's done barfing. Now he's using his psychic powers. I give up. I'm afraid boats don't suit my temperament. Are you alright? You look really pale. Hey, Joe Budiska. No, no, I'm fine. Sorry to worry you. I think I've thrown up what I'm gonna for now. Oops, excuse me! Not the kind of thing I ought to say in front of a lady. Oh, I thought he was about to puke again. Anyway, really should feel better now. So I'll be fine. Yep. Has she actually used uh, some of the uh, few Japanese words that I uh, I can recognize? Yeah. Daijoba Diska. Cabin 7. Oh, I guess she didn't say that. She said, let's see. The key. Here it is. Here it is, the key. Can I look at these other cabins? Yes. Cabin 3. This is the cabin across from ours, right? It belonged to that newlywed couple. Still haven't verified that. Hmm, it's locked. I thought we'd be able to get some avatar tax. Nope. Of course it is. Are you planning on becoming a thief? I'm just taking what's mine. Right. If you're the avatar in a video game, and, and in a video game, or, you know, just a video game main character, everything not nailed down rightfully belongs to you. Which is why it's As good to run a ship. I'm sorry? Which is why it's good to run a ship, because a lot of things yeah. are nailed down. Right. As I recall, this cabin belongs to a woman with thick glasses. Oh. She spelled thick wrong. <laughs> <laughs> you're very observant. I am a computer, you know. I think this was an empty cabin. Cabin 5. I see, so they skipped over cabin 4. I don't know if that's like a... Um, unlucky number in uh, mm. Japan or something. I think this was an empty cabin. Wow, two empty cabins. At least. Nope. That's not... Nothing to grab there. So here's my problem is that if we hit a perfect dead end, it does bring this menu up instead of checking. Whereas before, I don't think it did that. Right, but I'm kind of guessing that that's just for now. I don't know. Oh, now maybe. No, because if I'm standing in the middle of nowhere, it still does it. I think it's if there's nothing there. Right, no, but I mean, I, I, I'm, I'm guessing that it's going to change once we get to the investigation part. Is this the same old man or a different one? He looks different, but the name, I think, is the same. I think it's, well, it's a much more zoomed-in picture. Oh, yeah, yeah, we only had the little portrait before. That's right. Oh, you gave me a fright. Don't go calling out all of a sudden. Um, we didn't call out. And this place is off-limits to unauthorized people. Oh, well, oh there, now he's got the same Hannah <laughs> does the name. And I'm on janitorial duty, so it's to say, cleaning the passengers' rooms. I guarantee you'll have a bon voyage. <laughs> that that sounds like a threat. Uh, um, sounds like you're gonna murder me. Well, I'd best get to cleaning cabin six. Can I take some supplies? Nope. That's cabin one. Hey, look at this. Oh, 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 no, no, no. This is cabin one when I was supposed to be cleaning cabin six. Is he really on the crew? Will he be okay? He's going to stand there for a while. All right, let's check. Check him out the newlyweds. They're still here. Oh, everything's so pretty. Oh. Gig me with a spoon. <laughs> now you gotta do that with the accent, with the, uh, the valley girl accent. Weren't there stairs down, down below? There were, but I was kind of 
like going by to see if I noticed anything new in the restaurant. That's still the wrong place. No. We missed our chance to get him. Well, he is cleaning. I wonder if you can follow him into one of those rooms if you're fast enough, though. Can't, no. Full hatch, emergency exit. I get it. They use the store when they're loading the cargo into the hold. But maybe I shouldn't open it when it might be below water. It looks like it'll also be opened in times of emergency. I guess we're not that low. Oh, we're finding interesting things. The box is full of screws. Screws. There are tools like screwdrivers and wrenches too. You shouldn't touch him without a reason. Touch. touch I've got a reason. Touch. I'm a klepto. <laughs> I feel like the little wiggles we get stuck in. I know. Pretty great. Engine room. Authorized personnel only. Oh, we're authorized. We're gonna come down here later. Who's opening all these doors? Alright, he's still down there. Oh, that is the empty cabin. Okay, he is in the right cabin. Yeah. Alright. Are you still still feeling the same? Nope! He's feeling even worse. <laughs> Damn it! Oh no! Multiple choice. Oh no, it looks like your seasickness has gotten bad. You need to go rest in your cabin. Oh, sorry, cabin five, please. Cabin five, please. We're gonna space taxi him here. The key's here. And on the bed was a dead body. Uh, thanks. So disgraceful! Don't mention it. I think you should sleep for now. See ya! And then he chokes on his own vomit. Right Can we get... No, those are just his shoes. What do you get to say? Oh, confound it all! Just earlier, I careened straight into the passenger, into the passenger hearing cabin too. The bucket she was holding got knocked right over. So that's what's got me here cleaning this dirty floor, but don't you startle now. What was in the bucket was raw meat. What? Raw meat? Seriously, what in the world? Oh, well, that passenger's gone down to the hold. Uh, excuse me? Why All would right. they go down to the hold? Well, we'll find that out. Next time. See you then, everyone. Bye.